I got your juicy entertainment news for Wednesday. Drake has invested in Dave's Hot Chicken. It's a chicken chain based out of California. Uh, ain't no thing but a chicken wing. He purchased a minority stake in the chicken chain, giving him less than 50% ownership. He is now a part owner alongside Boston Red Sox chairman Tom Werner and Samuel L. Jackson, who we know loves his chicken. Um, and uh, they are now the three name, big name investors in Dave's Hot Chicken, which launched in 2017 as a pop-up chicken spot. It now has 22 locations, largely based in California, with plans of opening 25 more by the end of the year with expansions to cities including Chicago and Houston. There's actually two locations uh, in Toronto and Drake posted a picture of himself on Instagram with chicken tenders, pickles and fries from Dave saying, I tried the food. It was amazing. After meeting the founders and hearing their story, I jumped at the opportunity to invest. He obviously saw an opportunity to make some cha-ching. Uh, Manny Pacquiao is taking the fight outside of the ring and he will be running for Philippines president in 2022. He was nominated during the National Assembly of the PD, Laban Party, um, PDP rather, and uh, he said, you know, I'm a fighter. I will always be a fighter inside and outside the ring. In my whole life, I have not backed out of a fight. He said the Philippines needs progress. They need to win against poverty. They need the government to serve the people with integrity, compassion, and transparency. And he said he is now ready to rise to the challenge of leadership. It's going to be interesting to see how um, the folks feel for him in 2022. Dr. Dre is battling one of the most expensive divorces of all times. Um, now, check it out. A judge has just recently ordered him to pay the attorney fees for his ex-wife that are now in excess of $4 million. Besides a massive amount of spousal support, a judge just recently ordered Dre to pay an extra $1.55 million in attorney fees. Now, he's already shelled out two grand, or $2 million rather, um, in the past year, and then two separate payments of 500 grand each. So do the math. That's over $4 million. Those are some expensive lawyers. Like, wow. I think I'm in the wrong field. <laughs> Dre has been ordered to pay all of the lawyer's fees. You're asking why? Well, it's based on the disparity that exists between the two of them, uh, their assets and income. Nicole has assets totaling approximately $39 million, and Dre has approximately $243 million. So the judge feels that he should be paying the attorney's fees. Um, and that's not all. They've got to meet again to confer over what the cost might be to take the case to trial. So in other words, if they don't settle this divorce case, it might go down as the most expensive divorce case in history. And that's your Juicy Entertainment News for Wednesday. Lock it in again tomorrow for more of the juice right here. Oh, yeah. You can't forget about Dre on the all-new Kiss 96.